Hey everyone, in the news this week. A new controversial portrait of King Charles was revealed, which sees the king surrounded by the colour red in a quasi-modern art style. Reviews seem to be a bit mixed, although I don't really mind it. And it does have the one massive benefit that if the Just Stop Oil protesters ever get near it with a tin of red paint, they won't be able to damage it that much. Personally though, the style of it reminds me a lot more of that very brown and beige coloured painting, you know, the one from Ghostbusters 2, the haunted one that tried to kill people and take over the world. Or maybe the plan with this one is to stick it somewhere, you know, next to an old haunted painting of Queen Victoria or something, you know, for company. Talking about the king though, this week he also discussed his recent struggles with cancer and revealed that the treatment for it has cost him a sense of taste. I don't think that really comes as a surprise to anyone, though. Taste? I mean, this is the man that left Princess Diana for Camilla, of all people. In other news, though, Slovakian Prime Minister Robert Fico was shot this week, and authorities say he's, quote, not out of the woods yet. And that's pretty shocking. It's been nearly several days, and the ambulance is still stuck on some forest track in a wood somewhere. Pff, I thought the NHS had problems. A magician David Copperfield has been accused of doing a number of bad things with ladies, and I'm not talking about that time he sawed one in half. One of the girls was only 15 at the time, mind, so it's not really a joking matter, although I can't help but crack the observation that he might finally have to go to court and reveal his secrets. And finally, Meghan Markle was in Nigeria and gave a motivational speech to a group of teenage schoolgirls saying, quote, I see myself in all of you. I'm going to be honest, I'm pretty sure she stole that line, though, from one of Prince Andrew's old chat-up routines. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe.